Michael Pollock's working on the Blade 230S today and I'm going to show you how to replace the swash. And I think if you ask most pilots, it would be on their short list of recommended upgrades for micro helicopters with a plastic swash. You can see a little slack here in the links and we'll see if the new swash tightens that up a little bit so let's get started I'm going to be using a micro heli swash It's also one of the easiest upgrades to install. Okay, so all you need is one tool, a 1.5 millimeter hex. And what we do is just pop off the three links. And remove the screw from the head. Let's pop these two links off the inner swash. And then we can go ahead and take the head off. It's kind of tight. There we go. Now we can loosen the swash guide or you can take a chance like me and just bend it out of the way. So while we have uh, the swash off, let's just weigh it compared to the upgrade. Just see what it looks like here. In if we're adding any weight or not. All right, can you see that? Okay, so here's our stock swash, 4.63 grams. And our upgrade. 6.30 grams so it adds a little weight all right now we just reverse the process here put it on like so Head back on our main hub. Line up the hole in 
Shaft. Put our screw back in. Force it in. Want it to fit properly. Tighten it up. There we go. Connect to our inner swash. You can check your pitch after you change the swash, but it shouldn't really change anything. I'm comfortable. I've changed enough of these where I'm not even going to check it. I'll fill it out the first flight, but usually changing the swash, you don't have to go through your setup. So check this out. Still has a little slack in the balls, but not quite as much. And that's it. Very easy. Let's go out and give it a test flight. Thanks for watching.